Hey guys, so I got a few questions um, of how to get the f rid of the folders that you might have made by accident when you're moving your apps around. Um, now to move your apps, all you have to do is hold your finger on top of one until they start shaking like that and you just let go. Um, once you let go, you're going to see them shaking like that and you see that X. If you hit the X on the top left side, you're going to get rid of that app. And once you delete it, you can always get it back just go by going to your app store. You can look it up under history or, or just purchases and then just re-download it. So you won't lose it. Even if you paid for it, you won't have to pay for it again. Don't worry. Um, now, if you made an, a folder, and that's what we're discussing in this video, um, to get rid of the folder, so let's say I have this folder right here. Okay, what you guys have to actually do is get all the apps from there out of there. Okay, and that way you get rid of the folder. Okay, um, I'm gonna show you, so I'm gonna get out of that. To get out of that shakiness, just in case, press the home button. Now, I'm just gonna create a folder by accident just to show you how to. Um, so let's say you made a folder, so you drag one app on top of the other and you just let it go and you created this folder. Now you want to get rid of that folder, right? So I just made that folder, it's right there, it's called Predict Predictability. Um, if you want to change the name, you can change it to anything that you want. Um, I'm just going to click on it, okay, I'm going to hold my finger on, one, on top of one of the apps, okay. Then I'm going to just drag the app out of there and then just let it go and that's it. Um, same thing for the other one, drag it out of there and my folder is gone. So that's how you get rid of the folders that you may have made by accident or that you see on your iPhone if you bought a used one or whatever. And you want to get rid of all those folders, you can do that. You can um, also change your user ID and everything. Um, if you bought your iPhone, if it's used, I would suggest just uh, restoring it and put all your, all your personal information. Don't just start putting your personal information on the phone that's already activated. Uh, make sure to sync it up with iTunes or just go into your settings and from there restart and reset your whole iPhone. I have a um, whole other video just showing you more tweaks on your iPhone and everything that you want to know if you're new to iPhone. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can leave them here below and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.